Instead of looking for you. <laughs> Your reaction wasn't, oh, they're so lovely, or Esther, I love your glasses, so I'll stumble around on you for the notice. Oh, Esther, Esther, they're not fashion statements, they're medicated items. Easy for you to say, you're not the one stuck with these ancient frames. If you like them so much, why don't you wear them? No, thank you. I'm fine. Look, I'm not saying you should disregard personal style. All I'm saying is, Disregard how ugly they are and focus on the 2020 vision. I appreciate your effort to be nice, but I'll pass. Yeah. Do you think he likes me? <laughs> Why not? I mean, what's there not like about you? You're beautiful, you're smart, kind of funny, you're awesome. But I don't just think it's right for you to let him about your crush on him. Like your mom said, it could be distracting. Yeah, but I don't want to tell him. I just want to talk to him. And since when do you start listening to my mom? For boys like David, it would be very obvious. You know they are surrounded by girls. And it could be humiliating for you. But my mom said I should have courage when I want something. I'm very sure she never mentioned boys. But Esther, you know what it's like. I just want to talk to him. Fine. Don't blabber. Uh -huh. Just tell him how much you liked his show. Uh -huh. Be natural and neutral at the same time, uh -huh. despite your feelings. And trust me, if he's interested, he'll keep up the conversation, okay? I think I can do that. Fine. Okay. okay. I can do this. <laughs> Oh, you ready, nervous. right? Breathe in, yeah. out. All right. Hmm. Mm. Divine. Can you believe some people are already posting? Please tell me they suck and we actually have a chance at winning. They more than suck. Oh, excellent. Hmm. <laughs> What? Grace has been acting so weird recently. Ugh, I think she's taking bad advice. Hmm. Of course she is. I saw her talking to Victory. What did Victory do? Nothing. They were laughing with each other. Maybe something funny happened. You're definitely smarter than that. <laughs> Let's talk about this tomorrow. Huh? I'm too tired to think. Olive Bebekalin, what have you done? Uh, nothing. Mm, wrong. The whole school's talking about your encounter with Tudua Kana at their party last week. <laughs> you say that like I should be scared or something. They're the two most notorious seniors in our school. They should focus on their exams. Don't underestimate them. Last year, they locked up a just one student in the supply closet for the summer break. You may not care about scandals, but I have got all the gist. <laughs> oh, I can see your contacts. I don't think I could ever get used to my cell phone glasses. Okay, but they were super cute. Ah, Laya, that's not what you said. <laughs> <laughs> I guess nearly drowning has made me appreciative of things. Hmm. No wonder you're here painting my face instead of obsessing over homework. Huh. I'm feeling the pressure. Schoolwork plus social life equals attempted suicide. Finally! Welcome to my world. <laughs> <laughs> so, Archie, huh? What about him? What? 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 I thought I saw a spark. <laughs> Please, quench it. It's all in your mind. Haha, <laughs> really? Then what was the other day about? He's a nerd. I thought he was sweet. And I know for a fact that he's smart. He's a nerd. What's wrong with being a nerd? 
I'm a nerd. I don't want to hang out with another nerd. Come on, Esther, give him a chance. Why don't you go for him? You'd be perfect. Because. Because what? Ah. You're missing the point. You and Archie would be so cute. He'd balance each other out. Have you ever thought about what I want? Please, darling, tell me what she wants. I want tall, handsome, and smooth. That's some bumbling bookworm. You can't judge him till you get to know him. And yet, that's exactly what you're doing with Romeo. How do you think I feel when the attractive guys chase after you? Romeo, we hate each other's guts. Why are we even arguing about this? That was sisters before misters. I want the cute guys to chase after me too. I don't want Grace to be right about me. Esther, you know better than to listen to Grace. No, I don't. Yes, you do. <sighs> hmm. Do you still not know what Romeo wanted to see me for that day? Nope. You should ask him. <laughs> Forget it. No, ask him. Get it off your chest. And I will confront him and figure out why he's always showing up where I am. I'm pretty sure Iris and Ivy put him up to it. True, <laughs> alright. Alright. I can't have five o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> that grease girl, is she mad or something? Like a rabbit dog. What really happened? I don't know. How come everyone knows? Knows what? The reason I was suspended. Oh. Someone just announced it in the group chat this morning. Doesn't matter. I did what I did, and I'm sure everyone thinks I'm a hypocrite and I have no excuse. You don't owe them anything. Then why do I feel like I do? I feel so guilty. Olive, it's normal. Trust me, you may have the best intentions, but you're human and these things happen. You can't be so hard on yourself. You don't understand. I feel like a loser. But you are not. And everyone hates me. Let them hate you for all I care. Look, you did the best thing by owning up to it. Okay? Aren't you going to PE? You haven't even changed. I can't show my face after this morning. I will never go out in public again. You didn't have to kiss anyone, you know. I don't know what got into me. Crazy, crazy. I must be crazy. <sighs> Things we do for love. I didn't do it for that betrayer. I did it because I wanted to. Mm, if you say so. I want my solidarity now. You mean solitude, right? Get out! <laughs> See you later, darling. <laughs> what are you doing? Kill my chocolate, ah. chew it all up and spit it out, and then rinse your mouth. It was supposed to make me feel better. Isn't chocolate supposed to give you positive energy? It was just sticky and sweet. For someone who just got the highest GPA in SS2, you're pretty dumb sometimes. And you're not supposed to eat chocolate so disrespectfully. Sheesh, it not work that way. Esther. What? I was highest GPA by four feet. So? So? If Maria was present, then I wouldn't have been given the award. But she wasn't. I know. Which means I was the second highest GPA. Didn't you hear it's not final? And it's just a chance for you to gear up and get better. <sighs> I'm so lucky I don't have smart people problems. You worry about useless things. Okay, okay. This isn't useless, okay? This is my territory. If I'm second best at this, then where am I going to succeed? You just have to do better. That's all. You're right. I haven't been giving it my best recently. Did you need a stupid award to know that? Go and study, my friend. If 
like Mr. Mike just wants to watch the world burn. I mean, don't you know that we students are stressed about other things? Is this about Mr. Jack or David? <laughs> I saw you stealing glasses a few seconds ago. And in math class too. Olive, this is new for you. I just can't believe he said what he said to my face. <laughs> and I bet his handsome face made wondering easier. <laughs> well, just forget about the hater. You know what? You're right. Mm. Forgotten already. Can you imagine those fighting over me? What? Why? I was just talking to Archie and Julius comes out of nowhere and starts calling me his woman. <laughs> it's not funny. on purpose. I was trying to get in What is wrong with you? I said it was a mistake. Oh, please, Esther. You act up and throw a tantrum just because you didn't get your way. You think so? I'm quite familiar with the subject. I just can't believe that my best friend will turn out to be a very bubblehead. All because I refuse to go to the toilet looking like a random. I'd rather be a trustworthy ruffian than a classy sellout. Oh, well, you can try making that fear your own because guess what? I'm not helping you anymore! Who even wants you to help them? Traitor! Whatever! Well, David asked me to be his partner for the competition. Really? Mm -hmm. That's great. Mm -hmm. He'll play, you will sing. Exactly. Except Grace just totally stole him from me. What? Why? I don't know. She just showed up and said she wanted him to be her partner. Since when was she interested in things like this? Does she sing? I guess. You guess? You can't afford to guess. Think of your mom. Oh. I'll just find another partner. Lane. Just forget it. Let's think of other options. No. What about Adam? To Adam. His only talent is to annoy us. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Maria? She's been a bit depressed since her dad's death anniversary. What's that creepy smell for? <laughs> you're not thinking what I think you're thinking. Come on! Are you crazy? No! Think about it. And what will we be doing? We could sing. I can't sing. Okay. We can play an instrument. Never mind. Good. <gasps> what? We could dance. I... <gasps> That's not a bad idea. But we need a bump choreography. Mm, like, mm. any ideas? Why would Daniel's girlfriend teach us a dance routine? <laughs> Maybe because in her spare time she teaches a dance class at her university. How do you know that? <laughs> Told you I've got all the latest gist. Holy what? David is reading such an unexpected book and naturally I'd be interested. But would it be rude if I interrupted his reading? Or would he also be impressed at the fact that I know about his book? Yes, that's it. Thanks, Esther. Is it still showing? No. Nope. Now it looks like you peed yourself. Better than blood. You, sir, did you have to be so noisy about the whole thing? I was just annoyed at the way everyone made it such a big deal. Do you get your period monthly? Yeah, all women do. Exactly. So why were they making it seem like it's a new thing? Meanwhile, these same people watch movies where heads are flying off, vampires are biting into necks, for small blood stain, and they're acting like I've killed someone. <laughs> Should I apologize for something my body does naturally? Okay, Sassy Olive. Master, leave that soon. I don't like what I hate. Nobody let's go. I don't have any more clothes for you. I keep taking them home. I can't be stuck in this uniform. Yeah, the next time you bring her raw clothes now. Ah. By the way, where's Adam? Uh -huh. oh, why the boy has a beauty routine is beyond me. Eh, maybe he wants to be beautiful. Beautiful indeed. What? Dating? Stop. I can't bear it. Why are you doing it then? 
We're not. So, what's this? What's this thing between you and Adam? We're just pretending to get back at Senior Udwak for her song. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a lie. We're not pretending. Adam told me he liked me. And I'm still trying to process the entire situation. So it'd be really nice if you had my back instead of... Uh, I don't have all the answers, okay? What happened to you? How? What happened to the Olive who told me, school is most important and nothing can distract me? You know, if I lived by the truth of those words, then I wouldn't have time to be friends with you or Adam. Well, so are distractions. No. Look, all I'm saying is, I'm allowed to care about more than one thing. It's just priorities. When you had a crush on David, I thought to myself, these things happen and it's nice to see Olive behave like a regular teenage girl. But Adam, he's not like every other guy. He's your best friend. So I'll consider things properly before taking selfish steps that could ruin your friendship. That could ruin our friendship. Don't you think I know that? It is one thing to know it and it's another to live by it. What are you even mad at me for? Hmm. Madam, no, no, no. That's not how you cross the road. But there's nobody here. Did you check? Did you look left, right, and then left again? Really? Do it with me. Left, right, and left. Happy now? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Mm. Ah, Sigrid. Let's go and talk to her now. Mm. Hey, what? I think her and David are fighting. Huh? Where? Since when the other man, Maria, start coming to school together? <gasps> what was that? Oh, Olive, I know we're not in speaking terms right now, but I don't have anyone to tell my problems to. So please be my friend today, Olive. Step into my office. <laughs> Oh, you're not thinking so Julius now, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it seems the boy hasn't had contact with soap and water for months. He stinks, he smells, he reeks it. He does? I mean, it's unbearable. I feel like I've been parched with the smell for life. <laughs> but if Anita has been sitting beside him, why hasn't she said anything? Anita has a condition. I know it's blocked, always blocked, Seb. I scrubbed myself with an iron sponge. I've used all my father's perfumes. I've used all my deodorants. I've used all the antiseptics in the house by itself. No, it's smell me, smell me. A little soapy but clean. <laughs> I don't know what has gotten over Mr. Ben. He does not want to listen to me. He insists I continue sitting with Stinky Boy. He wants me to die. <laughs> I don't know what I was got to know about him. Maybe he's just trying to be impartial. And if Julius smells so bad, then tell him. Eh? Am I his mother? Even Adam says you know his things, but I don't want to be the one to tell him. If his fellow boys can say it, then why should I? Because you're a good neighbor. <laughs> Besides, we're teenagers. We're going through all kinds of bodily and hormonal changes. And if we don't take care of our bodies, we'll stink. <laughs> How do you know that? I guess I listen in biology. <gasps> Whatever it is, it is not my fault and it's not my job and I shouldn't be the one paying for it. Okay. But either you speak up or you suffer in silence. And Esther, if you decide to speak up, knowing the situation, be kind. Esther, be kind. <laughs> Total baby, right? <laughs> me. What me? He's a jerk. <laughs> what? Impossible. I heard he's a very sweet guy. <laughs> After what he just did to me. Sure. <laughs> They're only saying that because he's cute. So you appreciate his looks and you brought that upon yourself. Handsome face plus ugly attitude equals ugly. Period. Where did you see an ugly attitude? Ugh, plenty of times. Apart from trying to humiliate me just now, he's such an obvious flirt. Probably speaking to me so he can win a bet or something. He doesn't know I'm on to him. Oh, yeah. 
Yes. Oh wow. <laughs> this is serious. On to what? You literally said what a man can do, a woman can do better. And he called you out on it. I was just looking for trouble. He didn't have to be so mean. <laughs> I'm telling you, he's not all that. <laughs> well, I don't see it. You're mistaken. No, I'm not. I don't know what magic he has worked on you. He even met me the other day and said he wanted to talk to you. Said he had a message for you or something. What? And he didn't tell me? Oh, I forgot. I don't think it's important. Maybe not to you. Who would have told me? See me. What do you think? No, it's not. It's important. Please, Stop. No. Maybe. <laughs> wow. Go, <laughs> Navy! <laughs> Ice queen on the right. It feels empty without Adam towering over us. <laughs> Please, give the boy a break. After Maria's harassment, he needs it. Oh, true, true. <laughs> I need to go find me for our drinks. If we wait for Grace, we we'll die of thirst. <laughs> Esther! <laughs> what way you're going? What? Are you crazy? What are you talking about? Pedestrians have the right of way. Yeah, hey. but that wasn't a zebra crossing. <sighs> well, whatever. You should have seen me coming. It's actually the other way around. Why are you always on your phone? If I don't got the latest gist, how will you know the latest gist? Yes, sir. Have you thought that maybe, just maybe, I can live without the latest gist? <laughs> you can't. Nobody can. Why are you being so stubborn? In these types of impossible stances, I can't believe you're on the wrong side. Boy, I don't know what you're talking about. Why don't you just tell me what's wrong? Maybe not my best idea. What do you think you're doing? Do you want to destroy all our work? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So she started it. Oh, you are unbelievable. Stop it, both of you. Go home. With the party tomorrow, I hope you would have learned how to behave. I was so embarrassed. Like, for one, how could she just listen to my whole conversation? I literally ran out of the house. Oh, wow. What a disaster. Come on, Esther. What did you expect? You're lucky she didn't take your phone. Ah, uh ah, -uh, for what now? He's talking to a boy crying. That's not the point. What's the point? Ah, the point is no matter how modern our moms are, they're still our mothers. Our business will forever be their business. You and my mom need to mind your business. What's this for? Um, I'm, I'm protecting my hair from the elements. <laughs> uh, mm. What? What? Is that Archie? What? Who's that? I don't know. He's a player and a cheat. You don't know la, that. La, 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 la. Oh, oh. How do we get here? Oh. Oh, close. I, I see you. Oh. I won't make it. I think, oh. I think we made a mistake. At this rate, I don't think we'll make it to school tomorrow. Ow. Oh, I just pulled something in my butt. Oh. It's not going to work, honey. <laughs> If this is what it takes to be a dancer, I don't want to be a dancer. Yeah. I'm just going to get a job where no movement mm -hmm. whatsoever is required. You want to be dead? <laughs> even, even laughing hurts. <sighs> okay. That's my mom. Praise Jesus. Good luck with the pain. Mm -hmm. Bye. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> Mommy. Ow.